Hey there, here I am at Anchor Wat again. It's about 2 p.m., the sun's kind of dipping behind me, so I'm able to get some better photographs of stuff I couldn't see this morning very well. This is the first temple, I guess, that you come across as you enter the Anchor Wat complex. You're kind of on a little causeway here, and you cross this moat. It's probably three, four hundred feet wide. I don't know how deep it is. I just had lunch. Had some kind of chicken with pineapple and fried noodles for five dollars. A couple cans of Coke. And I gave him a bunch of worthless Cambodian money as a tip. It's funny, those little shop vendors, they come up to you and they say, you come, you come look at my store after you eat. And I said, okay, okay. And they tell me stall number three, stall number six. And then when I was done eating lunch, they said, you come look at my stall and I pretended to run away. Made the lady laugh. I don't really need anything right now as far as trinkets. This is, if you can believe it, this is the slow time of the day at Angkor Wat, as most people leave for a few hours for lunch. Then they come back in droves for the evening sunset. <laughs> I just talked to a Buddhist monk who said he's studying here, but he's from Singapore. So we kind of chatted about Singapore a little bit. So yeah, this is the first part of Angkor Wat that you see when you, when you come into the complex. Pretty impressive.